Look around. Neighbors won't have to wait until December to see the magic of Christmas. Participate in some reindeer games. I'm Malia Thomas in Valdosta, and I'm at Wild Adventures to show you what's in store for the winter season. I think the best part of Wild Adventures Christmas Wild and Bright will be the Gingerbread Village where we're standing now. Meet Elka Schultz. She works at Wild Adventures Marketing Department and has been working on Wild Adventures Christmas Wild and Bright every step of the way. She tells me the new attraction will bring a ton of brand new immersive experiences for our guests to enjoy. Uh, when they first come to the park, families will be able to visit the clubhouse and see Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer and some of his friends. That's not the only thing Wild Adventures is bringing in. I checked what Explore Georgia's 2022 report. Wild Adventures brings about 80 million to the area, making it a top contributor to Valdosta's economic impact, putting them in company with South Georgia Medical Center, Booty Air Force Base, Valdosta City Schools, and Lowes County Schools. The economic impact of Valdosta tourism was $387.8 million. About 7.4 of the share of the jobs in a county, which is about 5,100 jobs, are directly sustained by visitor spending. For the last year, Wild Adventures has been undergoing a multi-million dollar expansion to help bring in new visitors to increase these numbers. Wild Adventures Christmas is just the next step in uh, sharing these investments uh, with our guests. Uh, we are targeting Wild Adventures to be a new tradition for families, not just in our local area, but throughout the South. And I really do believe that Wild Adventures Christmas Wild and Bright will be the biggest Christmas celebration in the state of Georgia. 2024 season passes are currently on sale, so neighbors can go to the park for the rest of 2023, as well as the rest of 2024. I'm Malia Thomas, reporting for ABC 27.